Okay, so by now we should all be in a position where we have this A4 poster created. Okay, so what we're going to look at now is how we can design and create our background. So there's two ways I'm going to show you how you can create your background. Uh, one way using just one colour uh, and another way uh, we're going to use two colours and kind of uh, blend them. And I'll show you what I mean by that in just a second. So we'll start with the one colour way. Okay, so you're going to come over to the left of your screen over here. And you're going to see there's this tool here. Uh, if you hover over it, you'll see it's called the gradient tool. What we're going to do is we're going to hold down that and it's going to bring up a little menu for us. And we want the paint bucket tool. So we're going to select our paint bucket tool. Once we've got our paint bucket tool, we're going to come down here to the bottom left with these two colored squares. You're going to click the top one. Okay. Then we're going to pick a color we like. So I'm going to go for a lightish gray color. Okay. And then click OK. And then what we can do is we can click anywhere on our poster and that will change our background to the color we have chosen. Great. Nice and easy way to color our background. We're now going to look at uh, another way that we can color our background using two colors. Uh, and we're going to sort of blend them in the middle and I'll show you what I mean by that. So. In order to do that, what we're going to do is we're going to go back over here to where we found our paint bucket earlier. We're going to hold down again, and this time we're going to change back to the gradient tool. Okay, then what we need to do next is come back to these squares where we picked our colors earlier. And now we're going to have to pick two colors. So I'm going to keep my first color as this gray color that I've got. But I'm going to change my second color to a sort of reddish. Okay. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to come to the top left corner of my poster. I'm going to hold down the left mouse button and I'm going to drag towards the bottom right corner of my poster. And then when I let go, you'll see what happens is we've got our two colors. We start off with our first color and then we slowly transition into our second color with this nice blended area in the middle uh, like I spoke about previously. Now, the cool thing about this tool is you can change how you drag across the you know, your poster to change how the colors look and how they blend. So I could go from left to right like that. I could go from top to bottom. I could go from bottom right, uh, top right to bottom left. However you choose to draw across your screen, that's completely up to you. Uh, the colors you use, again, completely up to you, whatever you think suitable. Uh, so what I'd like you to do now is I'd like you to have a go at that and uh, color your background If you want to use the paint bucket tool and just use one color, that's fine If you'd like to try having a go with the gradient tool and get sort of a two colored approach like this, that's also fine